What's up, people? What's up, people? What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? Now, ladies and gentlemen, the picture you see today in front of you is a mother who killed her baby because of Farmville. Now, let me ask y'all a motherfucking question. How many damn times does Afro Joe, a.k.a. the Wookiees, gotta sit there and tell y'all, watch what the fuck you say and do on these damn websites? Oh, Lord Jesus, Afro Joe don't know what the hell he's talking about because y'all too damn dumb as shit just to realize whatever you do and say on the internet is gonna affect you in some way. The internet is your smoking gun. Quit sitting up there looking at me like I'm crazy. Now, this woman right here that you see, that you see, killed her baby because she was on fucking Facebook. She was on the Facebook, the Facebook. She killed her baby because of Facebook. Not MySpace, Facebook. I'm talking about the same Facebook where they made the damn movie out there. Know, the network, the social network, the little white boy that got rich and famous because of it. Yeah, how you like that rich white boy? A fucking mother killed her baby because of your motherfucking website. Oh, he don't give a damn. He's rolling around that damn money. Ooh, white woman killed her baby. Hallelujah, I got money, I got money, I got money. I'm telling y'all people. I sat here for motherfucking over a year now, busting my ass. Trying to tell y'all, watch what you say and do, because you don't know what the hell's gonna happen. No, Afro Joe don't know what the fuck he's talking about. He talking out the side of his neck. He talking that bullshit. Oh well, uh, over one year, I've did over 185 or 86 videos trying to show and tell people to watch what the hell they do and say, because you don't know what's gonna fucking happen. I'm going to say this, I told you so, I told you so, I told every last one of y'all so, woman kills her baby because of Facebook, hmm, thank you rich white boy that made this woman kill her baby because your damn website was worse than shit, oh, I don't blame every white person because this girl's mistake, I blame the boy that owns the site and this, this, and this white bitch that killed her baby. Because of motherfucking fucking Facebook. Oh, and it's funny, it's funny. People gonna look at me still and say, oh, Afro Joe, you full of shit. You don't know what the hell you talking about. If I don't know what the hell I'm talking about, why that why is this woman baby ain't alive? Why is this bitch walking free because after she killed her baby? Huh? Tell me that. Why is this girl getting off easy? Killing her baby because she was on Facebook playing Farmville. I don't get it, y'all. I can sit here every day. <laughs> I can sit here every day and tell y'all, watch what you're saying, dude. Don't get yourself caught up in this. Don't sit yourself. Don't sit there and get caught up in all this BS. Oh no, nah, Afro Joe don't know what he talking about. He he crazy. He crazy. He don't know what he talking about. He crazy. He on that door. He on that door. He on it though. He don't know. He talking about. He on. He on it though. No, it's not that. It's just the simple fact is I've been saying this for years on end. I've been saying this for years to watch what the hell you say and do because this can't affect your life more than ever. The internet is your smoking gun. Thank you, Facebook. Plus, this video is going up on Facebook. Plus, it's going up Facebook. And I hope that rich white boy boots my ass off of fucking Facebook. I blame him for that baby's death. I blame the owner of Facebook because of the baby's death. He's the murderer, same as the damn woman. He as much as guilty as the mother who killed the baby. He is just as guilty. Just as guilty. Oh, oh, and there you go. There y'all go, passing judgment, people. Looking at Afro Joe saying he's judging. He's judging. I'm not judging. I'm not judging. I'm just saying. He as much as guilty as this woman who killed her three month old baby. He is just as guilty. He knew the fucking consequences 
of his actions and of everybody else's actions. You gotta think about it. You gotta think about it. When you create a site, you gotta think about the pros and cons. I always say that the pros and cons. The pros and cons. The pros, good shit. Oh, get a lot of people on your site. Word of mouth. The name is the name of the site successful. Your name is successful. You getting money. The con. People dying. Kids getting molested. Pedophiles. Cyberbullying. Losing a lot of users because of your bullshit. See, pros and cons of every site there is. Now I'm doing a video response to Kevin Craft's video, and I hope he checks it out and checks out my page too on YouTube and realize over the year, over the year I did, and see that I've been doing this for over a year now, over a hundred and. 85 or 86 videos now, ladies and gentlemen. 185 or 86 videos. People gotta realize that Afro Joe's been saying this for them Jump Street. Don't look at me like I'm crazy, man. I gave y'all the warnings. I gave y'all the messages. I gave y'all the signs to watch what the hell you doing. The internet is your fucking smoking gun, and you don't know who the fuck is on the other side of that screen. You get caught up on these social networks like Facebook, MySpace, and others, man. Your life is going to be more fucked up than this girl's is. I already did a video about them kids getting kid uh, dying because of cyberbullying. Now look at it now. Some woman didn't kill her baby because, oh, she got addicted to Farmville. She got hooked on Facebook. Her Facebook was her crap. Her Facebook was her drug. Oh, feel sorry for the mama, but not for the baby. Oh, we love the mama. The mama should be walking free so she can kill another baby. Now, ladies and gentlemen, like I said, man, over a damn year, I've been trying to get people to realize what the hell I've been saying from Jump Street. Why ain't nobody waking up? Why ain't nobody waking up? Hello? Wake up now, ladies and gentlemen. Kids are dying. Mothers are killing their babies because of Facebook. Is Afro still crazy talking bullshit? No. Oh, he's starting to look uh like he knows what he's talking about. I'm telling you, wake up, ladies and gentlemen, because your life, life is too short to be chilling out on these damn Facebook, MySpace, YouTube, all this and that. And the reason why I've been doing these videos is because to tell y'all wake the hell on up and stop bullshit. Now, ladies and gentlemen, if you don't want your life to end up like this woman's, and you don't want your kids to die because of the internet, get the fuck off the damn computer and get the fuck outside. Because I'm tired of this shit, man. Turning on news, seeing kids dying because parents ain't doing their job, seeing parents killing their kids because of the internet because they hooked up on his Facebook, MySpace, YouTube. Get off your ass and get out there and do your fucking job. Stop letting our kids die because of the fucking internet. Get off your ass. Please get off your ass. And save these kids' lives. Save these kids' lives, man. I've been sitting here doing it, trying to get y'all to wake up and realize this. But no, y'all are too damn dumb to realize that, hey, this internet is killing our kids and our bodies. The longer we sit up here and let our kids... Get cyberbullying. Seeing mothers like this woman here kill their kids. The faster the population goes. Wake up everybody. Wake the hell on up. I'm tired of this man. I've been doing this for over a year now. And people ain't heard what the hell I said. Y'all can sit there and call me crazy. Y'all can sit there and call me stupid. But I know what the hell I've been talking about for over a year now. 185, 86 videos. I ought to tell you, this guy's been right from Jump Street. He's been right about Facebook. He's been right about Craigslist. He's been right about MySpace. Why ain't we listen? Because y'all sitting there doing more harm than good. Like I said, man, if you like what I got to say, write a comment. If, write a good comment. I don't need none of that damn negative comment. Oh, Afro Joe, you talking shit. No, I'm talking reality, baby. I'm talking about this is the real deal. This is not bullshit. This is not a fairy tale. This is all real, too. It's all real. Take a stand against cyberbullying. Take a stand to this Facebook BS. I'm telling you.
tired of this. I'm Afro Joe. Give me a good comment. None of that negative bullshit on me. Holla if, if you hear me on every place. Every place. Because I realize that I am the one that's sitting there helping y'all save your lives.